Gonna try mainly dumpster diving tonight. What is that? Oh, tube. See, this stuff that's put to the side, I ain't gonna mess with that because I'm not sure about it. This. I guess those screws ain't coming out like the other ones. All right. Not a lot, but better than nothing. Got some extrusion, some steel, all morts. Whoa, what have we got? An old chair. Nothing behind here.
see one more right underneath this. So, come on. Because of the way they cut it. Let's get it. What's up, kitty? I'll have to grab some stuff. I ain't doing it to try to scare you. Plastic. I'm gonna deal with plastic. I am move that back there because putting that in at the beginning of the night is going to fill up the truck too quick but if I put it back to the side I come back and get it with my other truck and trailer All right, onwards. What the bananas is this? See, what scares me is it's out here, which means it's probably heavy. And I doubt it's brass or anything. Oh, man. Bro. Oh. 
shit. Ow. I don't want that to happen again. Oh, there's brass though. Ooh, had my hand here. And I guess this started moving and smushed my hand in there. Let me see. So it's all steel. Snap, man. Let me check the dumpsters. That one's gonna be too heavy to leave behind. But that explains why it wasn't in a dumpster. Hmm. All right, let me go ahead and Probably should go put it in park. Had it in had it in neutral so it can move.
Let's do it. That's one heavy mate. clean up around here real quick and then I'll we'll be at the next stop onwards what is that oven no oh, look at them transformers oh snap get this piece of concrete out of here that uses some weight This is when I wish I had my screw gun. Oh. Too much to ask to say, hey, you got a screwdriver in here?
That's a lot of weight to it. One, two. <clears throat> Hold up. Ow. So this just poked the living heck out of my belly button. Ooh. Ouch, that hurt. go almost who that was heavy I did get all the transformers out of that thing that we picked up last night Should be one more transformer, but I don't see it. We didn't buy nothing. 
good last night. push this down here can you put it in yeah You can leave it there. It's good.
Huh? Say that they take motors and they they take pretty much if it can be separated, they separate it, but they do take uh those separate uh the motors, but I break those down. I don't sell it to them. So I tear them down. Yeah. Huh? If they're big enough, the smaller ones I don't mess with like that. They're just too much work for a little yeah. payout. I was at that big junkyard up on mine. Man, there's people waiting. Where was this at? Up on Lyman. That's one of the big ones. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they, yeah, they've been really busy over there. Yeah, that's crazy. They paid a little more, I think. Yeah, I go to... Kaylee. Kaylee is uh, really strict. Yeah, well, if you have a license, I have a license. Um, but they're really picky. Like, you can't, you can't have a refrigerator that doesn't have Freon. If you do, they'll fine you and all this other stuff. So I don't even really... I don't like going there that much. I do use them, but only for regular steel. If I have a refrigerator, I go out to force them. Huh? Yeah. Yeah, but I go out to Biplo on East Colonial to ENH car crushing. They take everything. Yeah. They got hundreds of them. Yeah. You go up there? Yep, and they'll pay you out the window. You're welcome. You want this? It was laying on the side of my truck. All right, almost.
You ready? Huh? No, one light, one camera. <laughs> Alright, one more. Alright, so we are done. Um, majority of our money came from radiators I had sitting at the house. That's one of the reasons why I do put stuff to the side. Um, and don't tear everything down at once because when I have a bad night like last night where it was only... $33 worth of tin, which is actually pretty good. I ain't gonna lie. That's 520 562 pounds of tin. Um which got us a good amount of money. I mean it, it didn't make us rich, but it gave us money. So And because I stayed home tearing stuff down, we ended up going to this scrapyard just because it's already out here. And, well, Forsyth, our ENH closes. They'd already be closed right now. So, yeah, they closed like 15 minutes ago. Um, so, TMR is the first one to close. They're off Cayley Street. Um, they pay the most out of all scrap yards, but they're the furthest from me um, Furthest but not the longest to get to because the highway leads straight to them um, ENH is the second furthest from me But it takes 45 minutes to get there. So it might as well be the longest and they pay the lowest This one's 15 minutes from me it's just that I can't really use the dump trailer here because everything has to be loaded into a bin. Um, but this place is probably five, 10 minutes from me, if that. Um, so, and their prices are pretty decent. They're usually more than ENH, but always less than TMR because they sell the TMR. But yeah, well, if you haven't already, hit that like button, subscribe, and we'll catch you next time. Bye-bye for now.